This video will explain testing and executing in Synatic. At the end of this video, you will have learned how to test and how to execute a flow. Testing is done in the flow on a step. There are test points in the steps that are added to a flow. These allow you to test a flow up to that point. For example, clicking on the test button on the pass-through step will show data up to that point before it has been processed by any of the other steps in the flow. Take note that testing only returns a maximum of 100 records to see the data set. To test a flow, click on the play icon in the step you want to test. The test dialog will open. Make sure that the override source box is not selected if you are testing data from the source step. Alternatively, you can choose to upload a file to test or type in the data in either JSON, XML, or text format. In this example, we will test data in the source step so the override source box will not be selected. Click on that box to unselect it and then click on the test button. The test results will be displayed at the bottom of the screen. The record stats will be shown under the steps tested to that point as shown. Hover the mouse to see the number of records that were completed, skipped, or failed. Executing a flow will send all the records to the destination. The flow will run, and all records will be processed. To execute a flow, click on the Execute Flow button. The Run dialog will open. Click on the Create Run button. Details of the run will be displayed once the run is completed. You have now learned how to test and execute flows in Synatic. Thanks for watching.